Hi everyone, I'm Asifa Lahore. I'm Britain's first out Muslim drag queen and I am doing a takeover today for Sassify. I featured in an interview in the Sassify Queeros edition. You can get it physical form or you can read it online as well. So let me tell you a little bit about myself. I have had the privilege of coming out twice. And I say it's a privilege. I am now at the grand, amazing age at 37. And I came out when I was 23. I came out as a gay man uh, to my parents, which was a very, very long road. So I come from uh, quite a conservative, Muslim, British, Pakistani background. Um, and I know a lot of young people like tend to come out really, really young now, but I kept my sexuality very, very low key for a long time, simply because I knew that it would cause such a ripple and I'd face so many challenges, um, you know, identifying as Muslim, queer, gay. So I chose to leave it really to the last minute um when i was 23 and honey i was taken to like the gp i was taken to the imam i even agreed to like an arranged marriage to my first cousin in pakistan who was female um that didn't last long obviously it lasted six months because i put my foot down and got counseling and i basically put my foot down in order to tell my parents look i'm gay this is who i am and what began was like a process and journey of reconciliation with my parents. Um, I began doing drag about eight years ago in 2012 and I entered Drag Idol UK. Uh, um, that year and it was that competition that gave me the, the, the title of Britain's first out Muslim drag queen uh, because I was the first um, drag queen of Muslim and Asian, or in this case, South Asian um, ethnicity to enter that um, competition. And I won the bronze award and it just kickstarted my career. I began like getting um, gigs. I began performing up and down the country. I went I went on to do like documentaries, Muslim drag queens for Channel 4. Uh, you can check that out on E4 and on um, All 4, the app. It's an amazing documentary that was narrated by Sir Ian McKellen. Um, and then later on, when I was 33, which wasn't that long ago, about four years ago, three, four years ago, I ended up coming out as transgender because it was through my drag that I realized that actually I'm a trans woman. And even though I love performing and doing my stage shows and just performing in drag, I realized that living as a woman was really important to me as well. That, you know, I wanted to medically transition and I wanted to live in the gender that I felt the most comfortable with. So yeah, if you have any questions, let me know. Um, and I really hope that this helps people in many ways because people of color, especially people like myself, uh, people of color, then being queer and then being, you know, British and Pakistani, it can be quite a big deal for a lot of people, especially when you're not seeing yourself out there in, you know, in many mainstream spaces, it can be very difficult to see yourself and find yourself. So I really hope that, you know, this reaches a lot of people. And I really hope that through Sassify, um, you are inspired. And happy pride to everyone out there.